Hey everyone, today I will show you how to update the Windows 11 system that refused to update the usual way. The problem I had to deal with is I have an old feature stand like 22H2 and I know there's 24H4 already available, but my computer can't make any feature update to this build. In the Windows Update section, I saw messages like this. Your version of Windows has reached the end of service. But check for updates, do not update anything. Messages like this. Your device is missing important security updates. Make sure to keep your device on and plugged in so updates can complete. Another message is this. Your version of Windows has reached the end of service. Same here, when I click check for updates, nothing happens. I've encountered this issue multiple times on both Windows 10 and Windows 11. And there can be several possible causes. In this guide, I will walk you through some simple troubleshooting tips and at the end, I will share a pro tip that has always worked for me. Let's go. First of all, make sure your internet connection is stable. If you're on a public or restricted network, like in a hotel or company, it might block Windows Update. Company-owned devices may have update restrictions set by IT. If that's your case, reach out to your administrator. Free up disk space. Make sure you have enough free space on your system drive, usually the C drive. If the bar is red, you're running low. Delete unused files or run disk cleanup. Clear the software distribution folder. This is where Windows stores temporary update files. Sometimes it helps to delete it. Open File Explorer and go to C, Windows, Software Distribution. You can delete the entire software distribution folder. In my case, it did not work because maybe Windows Update Service is running. Uh, let me check that for a second. Maybe this service has files open from the software distribution folder. So I will stop this. Right click, stop, or on the top here with the stop icon. Okay. We try again to delete the software distribution folder. It's done. And then <laughs> go back to Windows Update and click check for updates. Windows will recreate the folder automatically. Here it is. The next tip is try a restart. You have probably done this already, but just in case, a classic reboot often solves more than we think. Not just shut down and start the machine again, click restart. It's better. And now the solution that always works. Download the latest Windows 11 ISO. Go to the official Microsoft page, link in the video description. Scroll down to download Windows 11 disk image ISO 4x64 devices. Select Windows 11 multi-edition ISO from the drop-down. Choose your language, confirm, then click 64-bit download. 
wait for the about 5 to 6 GB download to finish. Only download the ISO from Microsoft, never from third party sites. Then mount and install the ISO. Go to your downloads folder, double click the ISO file, it will mount like a virtual DVD. Open the mounted drive and double click setup.exe. Windows will now check your system and prepare the upgrade. Make sure it says install Windows 11 and keep personal files and apps. That's important. Otherwise, change that setting. Click install and let Windows do its thing. Your PC will restart a few times. Once it's done, check your version using WinWare. Just type WinWare, enter, and you see your Windows version here. You should now be on the latest Windows 11 build. And that's it. If this helped you out, leave a like or even better, support me with a subscription. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.